learn the art of noticing things and realizing and just listening and being present. You would see yourself enjoying life more and more and more. And I know it's hard for some of that, bro. Trust me, it's been hard. Life is hard, bro. Like, the things that we go through, there is no reason to be going through. Like, you can't even explain, like, why is it happening to me? I know, like, some of you guys, like, think, like, why is it happening to me? Or, like, why is this going on? Just know that everything happens for a reason. And you don't know the reason. So let's say like um, the most unfortunate things happen, like you drop your phone. There's a reason that happened because like maybe two weeks later you're getting another phone. You see, if you hadn't dropped that phone, you wouldn't have gotten the other phone two weeks later. So don't stress about the things you can't control. And like, just, yeah, like, mm. like don't, don't, yeah, don't stress about the things you can't control, bro. They're out of your control. You have to just focus on what you can't control. Mm. Mm -hmm. And even for me, some of my biggest <coughs> successes or biggest have wins have come from my failures. Mm -hmm. have come from the toughest moments, you know. Have come from places where it's just like you don't know how it's going to turn out, and some, you want to control it. You want to have control of everything, and then your mind starts racing on what could go wrong, you know. True. But then I, I, I saw, and someone said this like, why do we spend energy, even if your circumstances seem so dull right now? Why do you spend energy thinking about the negative? You, what about if? What about this could go better than I could ever imagine? You know, putting yeah, energy yeah. into that. And it's hard because anxiety is hard. It's something that I go through, mm -hmm. you know, it's like, and, and someone who's ambitious, you want to do things and, you know, the unknown. But what you said was very powerful is being present. And you know what half the battle is? Mm. You know what the biggest battle is? Mm. It's like you said, awareness, mm -hmm. noticing. Mm -hmm. When you start to notice the thoughts that you have, that's when you can check it. Because we're all going to have anxious thoughts. Every the Every single day we're going to have them. You can't get rid of it. You mm -hmm. can't get rid of that part of the mind that wants to have things figured out. That when things are looking so stormy and things are not looking the best and you don't know how you're going to get out of the situation. Why is this happening to me? Mm -hmm. In those moments when you just become aware of it. And hold on Eve, what am I thinking about? No, it is already done. Walk in the light, it's done. It's okay. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? And mm -hmm. that's power. Power and awareness. Like, that's like, bro, I'm, I'm, that's something I wanted to say. Damn, I just felt better. But like, yeah, um, awareness is like one of the, even footballers need, need that, bro. And if you don't have awareness, you're not a good footballer, bro. Because mm -hmm. you won't be knowing what's going on, bro. So I'm, it's like, <sighs> bro, it's so easy yet hard at the same time to go through life. But like, when you let go, is what I could say, yeah. Let go, when you let go and you stop overthinking, and I know overthinking is hard, I go through that a lot as well. Like, you go through that too? I overthink so much, like, something could have happened, and I'm just thinking of like, like, okay, let's say like, I, I said hi to you, and you said hi to me, like, like, I, I'll just be thinking like, all possible things I might have done wrong in those few seconds to make you say hi like that, bro. I don't know why, I just overthink. Oh, oh and I remember what I was gonna say, like, oh, the, your failures come from? You, uh, you? My biggest wins Successes came from, from my biggest failures. failures. I, was, I was heartbroken. I was like, damn, why is this happening to me? I'm so hurt, I'm so... But bro, if it didn't happen, where would my lost be? Where the, I wouldn't have anything to write songs about. So now I'm thinking back at it, I'm like, damn, that time I was really hurt. I was saying like, why is this happening to me? I wish I could like stop this feeling, how I'm feeling. But now I'm like, damn, I'm happy that happened because like that's gotten me like where I am right now, bro. Oh, so you just thought about that right now, huh? Yeah, yeah like I just thought about it as you said, I was like, damn, for real. Mm. <laughs> like I'm happy that happened. If that didn't happen, I wouldn't have anything to write my songs about. Mm. So like. It's, it's, that's, that's a crazy statement, that's like mm. far as hell, bro. And, and it's like, you know what I love about this and I love about us is... Hey guys, this is Eve Rubasha here at the Just Co offices. Made for entrepreneurs by entrepreneurs. You see, we're living in the greatest time to be alive, where you can use the power of social media, where you can get your voice out there, your brand. How can you put yourself in the front position? 
How can you use and utilize a media network to be able to build your brand? That is the mistake so many people make. They don't know how to build brand. They don't know how to use their voice and the art of communication to storytell. We have that platform, the Rabasha Family Podcast, made for entrepreneurs by entrepreneurs, where you could utilize the power of social media to get your voice out there. You're gonna either do two things, you're gonna keep scrolling, or you're gonna take action and create history with the revolutionists. You have one choice. Don't be like the 98%, take action now. In life, you should always keep that childlike spirit. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Like, when you're a child, look at Janelle, she's there, she's crazy, she's laughing, she's happy. You know, what's up, Janelle? You know? I feel happiness. You know, you, happiness. like, you, we should keep that spirit, but life happens to us and then, you know, we start to get away from that. But even with me and you, like, mm. what, what's our age difference? Bro, this yeah. nigga's pushing 30 Yeah, don't tease me about that yesterday. This nigga's pushing 30 on the team. man said that yesterday and I was laughing. I was like, raw. <laughs> Human judge just said that shame. Just anyhow. I was like, yo, damn. But, so, nearly 10 years. Mm. But you couldn't even think that. You know what For I mean? I'm, I'm with them, like, because I'm, 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 I never want to let go of that childlike spirit. And that's why, when I'm in public, bro, yeah, I just be doing some, I just be playing, things, I be bro. doing my music, up, you know what I mean? Yeah. Because it's like, why should we? Nah, I'm a child at heart, and I'll always be that child. And I want to bring that child out even more. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? It's like crazy. Like if if this guy was like a boring 27 year old, do you think I would even be here? Like, <laughs> do you think I would even want to sleep over here if this guy was just some regular boring 27 year? Old? Just be like, oh, okay, our uncle is not even our cousin anymore. He's our uncle at this point. Our uncle is, but, but no, nah, this guy is cool. Like I actually look forward to when he's coming because well, I know I'm gonna have fun, bro. That's the crazy thing. <laughs> And we always have and fun. And we always do, bro. I know you're watching this video, but real quick, please, guys, please, make sure you, you take the time to like, share, and subscribe. Go and hit the subscribe button so we can keep giving you guys content. So you guys can be notified as soon as we drop, as soon as we drop some news and information that's really gonna help you. And then, another thing, guys, and by the way, subscribing it doesn't cost any money, it doesn't nothing. No dollars, just go in there, hit the subscribe button. Again, Spotify, make sure you download our episodes on Spotify. We are exclusive to Spotify because we are getting that deal you know what i'm saying we're getting that million dollar deal so if you want to listen to the rebasha family podcast you have to go on spotify